Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Pop Art Hunter channel. And today we have a bunch of different packages. We have some unboxings and one on bubble wrapping. Lots of uh, packages typically means one thing. It's lots of Ninja Turtles or action figures. Uh, I tend to get a lot of bits and bobbles, accessories and figures. And so I can only imagine that's what these are. But well, let's uh, go ahead and crack them open, see what's inside. All right, so, uh, this box says do not cut bottom. Character card on bottom. When it says character card, I think it's Teenage, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles because I get those with the character cards, but it's telling me I have to cut on the bottom. And here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut on the bottom. Because why? Number one, you can't tell me what to do. You're not my real mom. You can't tell me not to uh, do something. Uh, number two is I always like to hide the address information for protection of the innocent. Uh, so I wanna make sure that I'm not revealing the seller's or sender's address stuff. And I don't wanna have to go tape it up and all that stuff. So I'm just gonna be careful and unbox it from the bottom. Here, so let's go ahead and try that. I'll probably end up destroying something. No, 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 I'll be careful. Just gotta be careful with this. If you just don't wanna slice this hot way, you gotta lift up on the sides out a little bit. And that usually makes it okay. Makes it good enough. Okay. And let's go ahead and cut these open. So we're unencumbered by the opening process. And we can uh, just focus on enjoying the unboxings. Oh, I can just open that one side there, I think. Maybe not. <laughs> Yeah, that's open. That's good. Let's get this this one here. So, I'm guessing again these are going to be TMNT just because that one said um, car, card back, but also because anytime I get multiple tiny little packages, it indicates that for me. But it's because I order those in such a big quantity these days. Uh, I don't know where my scissors are. Usually I like to use scissors on these, but I'll go ahead and I'll make an exception. Okay, we're good to go. We are good to go. What do we got here? We got something. We got a thing. We've got stuff. Now we do get some Ninja Turtles. So this is a wacky action Leonardo. And I don't believe I have a wacky action Leonardo. I think that he moves his arm around in like a fist punch. Yeah, there we go. Little fist pump in action. He's got his accessories. I, be I believe this uh, might even be all of his accessories. A little uh, whip, a uh, little mace, and a little snake pole thingy. Yeah, so we got those. I'm good to go there. So one out of the way, add it to the collection. What do we got here? All right, we got a uh, mutating bebop. And there's one of his hands. <laughs> I don't know if this is broken. Oh, it looks like it's maybe broken. Well, that's too bad. Yeah, so it looks like it's snapped off. There's something that snapped in the shipping or that was always that way. But that is broken, so that's pr pretty much useless. I mean, this is gonna be a custom figure, possibly. I mean, you can still leave it in there, but it doesn't even close up that well because it's not connected. So that's not good, not thrilled by that. But we got some accessories here. Oh, well, you know what? Now that I opened this, I remember. I knew that this was broken, I think. <laughs> I think I want, you know what? I think I wanted it for these weapons. I, I was just remembering, I was like, cause I've already got one of these that's complete. I'm wondering myself, why did I get this? So yeah, I think I wanted uh, these weapons on the bottom of the feet here. So I believe that you can take these out. I'm just looking here. Yeah, yeah, so you can take these out. So I think I wanted these extra weapons out. I think I have a second mutating uh, Bebop, and I, I think he's missing out on some of those weapons. Christ is averted, I'm not upset, because I, wa I want that figure in order to do that. Okay, we got uh, mutating Rocksteady. Let's see here. So he's got his little pads on. Looks like his arm is okay there. His arm is okay there. These don't have any, anything on the feet. So these are more important to that they are contained because, um, you know, there's not like any accessories to take out. I don't know what goes in the little kneecaps here. I don't even know what's supposed to be in there. I've never, I've never, I guess I've never opened these up here on uh, Rocksteady. 
So I'm gonna have to figure that out, see what goes in there. Maybe his accessories go in there, some kind of weapons or something. I, I honestly don't, I don't know, I've never seen it. I've never seen a mutate and restock, or bebop in, in the flesh. So I don't really know what goes inside that. Okay. Let me throw all the accessories out there. Uh, I got some other accessories here. These I'll go with the Bebop. This is a, a, a rock city, a Bebop knife. We have this for the rockin' somebody. And then a couple other little bits and pieces. I don't I know exactly what they are. So, we're just going in, the, in the, that pile for all my accessories. Let's open the card back first. This will be the reveal of what it is. Oh, God. Good. Napoleon Bonafrog. Now, I think I already have Napoleon Bonafrog, but I think I might be missing an accessory for him. And hopefully that accessory is in here. Um, I have two Napoleon Bonafrogs. One has a little pink peace symbol on his neck and one has uh, a green one. So there's a green one and a, a pink one. And I have a, a full Napoleon Bonafrog but without this little creature guy. So I'm gonna be adding him to the one uh, now Napoleon Bruno Frog that I'm missing the piece for. And then this, I'm assuming, must be the Napoleon Bruno Frog. So will it be a pink or a green peace sign? Uh, so this is the green one. So see this little peace symbol that is green? Um, on some of the figures, it'll be this pink color. Yeah. Okay, I got that one out of the way. And one last box. Oh, okay. I, I started kind of collecting some of the NECA stuff. Um, and this is a uh, Chucky, Bride of Chucky, uh, Chucky figure. It was a reasonable price. I went ahead and bought it. Why not? And I think I have some other stuff in here as well. Okay. Wonderful. So here we have a Genghis frog. Here we have a pro uh, pilot Don. Actually, <laughs> I just ordered four more of these today for a little project I'm working on. Could have just ordered three more now that I know about that one. We have uh, a Triceraton missing a tail. Probably gonna be just a parts huh? parts piece. We got a Donatello. I think I got more accessories for him. We've got this little ninja Michelangelo. Looks like his head maybe doesn't want to stay down, so that might be broke. I don't know, I'll have to I'll have to look at a little bit further here. Yeah, it looks like it's kind of having some issues here, so and that might be, be broke. And then we got a wacky action Michelangelo. Yeah, and I think my, my wacky action Michelangelo doesn't spin that nicely, so I might replace that one with that, with this one. So that 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 and this one's uh, probably worth it. Again, I wish I would have saw that a little bit earlier. Oh, yeah, I got this Bride of Chucky NECA, uh, so that'll add uh, my new movie NECA collection, the Ultimate NECA collection. So yeah, lots of different stuff here, lots of different turtles. We got Bride of Chucky. We got the back uh, card here, which I think I'm missing one for the uh, n the other Napoleon Bonafrog I had, the variant one. Uh, and that's a nice card, actually. I almost don't want to cut it, but I will. Uh, and then all these different accessories that we can add uh, to my piles of accessories. So, so far, pretty good score, I think. Part of the fun of collecting the loose figures for me is trying to find all the little bits and baubles and the accessories and weapons that go with these uh, figures so that I can become complete. A loose figure is not it's not happy without being complete. And so I want to make sure I complete them. And so being able to find all these little pieces and 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 complete those figures is a joy for me. And then I end up with extras that I can pass along to other collectors so they can complete their fig figures and they can have just as much joy as I do. So I'm happy to get all these things unboxed. I'm happy to uh, start... Uh, putting the little pieces into their proper locations, into their final homes, uh, so to speak, and uh, getting those figures complete. Thanks for watching the Pop Art Hunter channel. Please like, subscribe, comment, all those sorts of things. That helps us out on the channel a great deal to keep making stuff that you enjoy, and whether that be Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and the unboxings, or uh, maybe even some of our other stuff like posters and concept art and book looks and animation cells and things like that. So do all those things, like, subscribe, interact, uh, and also check out those other videos. We'll see you next time right here on the Pop Art Hunter channel. Channel. <laughs>